G'day folks, how you doing? I want to have a chat about the cannabis political groups in this country. Yes, I do. And there's two of them to be precise. Uh, some are for, some I really don't know. Uh, but I want to uh, answer a couple of questions that I've had asked on the channel. That is, who would I vote for out of the two parties to help or get legalized cannabis in Australia? Recreational, that is, cannabis uh, legal to the standards of which most consumers want it or need it, should I say. Um, you know, and I think there are huge contrasts in between, um, you know, the types of uh, representatives we have in politics at the moment. Uh, we'll start with the Greens. Uh, the Greens, basically, when the Greens came in uh, to politics, it was uh, emphasised that they would fight for, for cannabis, to legalise cannabis. Of course, most people, um, I mean, that, that was pretty much their whole movement, the whole green movement, you know, uh, tree hugging and, and that kind of thing. But over the years, um, and, and, and in fact, I'm not sure if that's, I think cannabis is, was used by these parties, particularly the Greens, to get ahead, to get the vote of the cannabis consumer. Uh, uh, to get the compassionate vote of people uh, who, you know, hope to legalise cannabis, uh, work to, uh, uh, you know, to that goal. Over the years, I think they've lost their way. They've started to fight for other, uh, other rights which have nothing to do in terms of cannabis, which is fine, uh, but we do as a consumer, as a cannabis uh, uh, person, I live a cannabis lifestyle, it's important for me to focus on what uh, I need and the cannabis community needs to succeed and move forward to legalization, decriminalization, whatever you want to call it, recreational consumption. Uh, so I really don't think the Greens have what it takes. I don't think they are on the side of the consumer. Uh, we've come so far within the medical realm in cannabis that uh, I really don't think there's much more we can do in terms of that, uh, but it's still, it's still, uh, you know, the Greens, uh, you know, the whole title of the Greens, the whole movement of the Greens of how they've changed, uh, started to fight, I suppose, for uh, different types of rights, which is, you know, all good and well, but it's important to understand that within the cannabis movement, we need promises. We need promises from uh, politicians who are in the realm. And at the moment, I haven't seen any promises from the Greens. Uh, I've seen uh, a lot of stuff, actions and, and things to move forward. But at the moment, cannabis is still um, not legal for everybody. Uh, so, uh, yeah, again, as I said, the, the movements that they are touching on now, for example, they're getting highly political in terms of uh, stuff that's going on overseas, wars and other things that really cannabis... Uh, people, cannabis communities, not interested in. We just don't care about. So we don't want to. Are they going to get the vote of the cannabis consumers? No. The, the Greens will never, never. I mean, they might have in the past, but I do see that changing quite fast uh, because, you know, it's 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 seen uh, by consumers that the Greens don't represent what the general cannabis society uh, consumers and people who are living the cannabis lifestyle represent. Uh, they really don't represent what um, you know is needed within the communities. Uh, so that's one, the Greens. The other party is the Legalised Cannabis Party. Now the title again should say it all, Legalised Cannabis. Uh, again, uh, cannabis is not legal uh, yet, they haven't done that job. They've uh, sort of made promises and moves uh, also like the Greens. Uh, but the Legalised Cannabis Party are dedicated to cannabis. Uh, for example, their goals reach uh, further, for example, after legalisation of cannabis. Uh, and they also uh, respect and have a, a lot of inclusive um, conversations when, when it comes to the cannabis community uh, and consumers, all levels of consumers, all types of cannabis consumers, not just someone who might have a medical title, uh, because you know, it's, it's, it should be understood that most people use cannabis for recreational purposes. If it didn't get you high, they wouldn't. Uh, they wouldn't consume it. Uh, they would only consume it as a, a medical product. And of course, they wouldn't be uh, consuming it in particular ways, uh, in, in ways that are harmful. But uh, as for um, the Legalised Cannabis Party, 
I think they, they have what it takes to, to get our message across. I do. I think the Legalised Can Legalize Cannabis Party has the motivation. They have the support of the right people. Uh, they don't have, uh, unlike I've seen the, the Greens are in all types of pockets, um, and legalization, the Legalised Cannabis Party, the, the members of the party are getting involved with the community. They are actively getting involved in the community. Now, I was in the Greens office um, a couple of weeks ago in our parliament in Adelaide. I had some conversations and reached out uh, to some of the Greens uh, members, or one of the main Green members here. Uh, let, let them know that we're here. Uh, I'm here to help and support and connect people and, 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 and you know, really get involved proactively that way. I've never, I haven't had a, a, a call back or anything like that. Um, and if I suppose if anyone's in the know, it's going to be me. Uh, I'm, I do suppose that I am uh, pretty headstrong, right? I know where I'm going. I know what I want. And I know uh, uh, we need promises. We need promises from the Legalisation Cannabis Party. We need uh, promises from the Greens. We don't need your talking. We don't need you going, yap, 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 and tell us and all the good stuff. We know about the good stuff. We know about all of that. Your work is good. It's good, but you're not achieving anything. You're not achieving anything. Uh, that goes down to all of the parties. Uh, out of the two, obviously the Legalised Cannabis Party is dedicated to cannabis. And for cannabis consumers, if you are dedicated to cannabis, if you understand and love this plant uh, and, and support it fully, so we don't need lukewarm cannabis people. Uh, and that's what I feel with the Greens, a very lukewarm cannabis. Uh, and, and it's not really a priority of theirs. Um, you know, they really don't understand the culture. But can they make a difference? Well, I hope they can, I really do. Um, um, but at this point, there is only one party that is for cannabis. There's only one party right now that is dedicated to cannabis and that's the Legalised Cannabis Party. Uh, I don't work for them, I get no kickbacks, nobody's discussed anything with me whatsoever uh, about uh, my opinions. These are observations and, and things that I've experienced uh, been seen and told and and again I, I understand as politicians the politicians out there might think they have an academic achievement above mine that tells them that they understand they can talk about this topic uh, more so than I uh, but I'm the one with the support uh, I'm supported in the cannabis community and I'm trusted my word is trusted and um, unfortunately for both parties cannabis is not legalized so you both better pick up uh, pick it up, start moving, start making promises, start making moves, okay, stop stop selling us out, do not abuse the cannabis community, do not abuse cannabis people, uh, that's responsibilities that you have, we are the custodians of cannabis, I am a custodian of cannabis here in Australia, uh, and there's a massive community, thousands, hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people around Australia who support this movement, so, to the Greens, to the legalization cannabis party, pull your bloody head in. Because uh, I tell you, a fair dinkum, fair dinkum, yeah, you're not doing the right thing. You're not getting the job done. You're not getting it done. If you want our vote, make some promises. Make some promises and get the job done. Grow on Australia, roll together, grow together, bong on together.